and good morning class so for today we'll be looking at uh, we'll be looking at reflection and refraction we will be working on a virtual lab we'll be using a simulation from PHET um, Colorado um, so basically um, it's it's a somehow program that we can use in order to mimic what will happen in real life so for um, in this case you you will see you have um, you have this um, screen here that is divided into two parts so you have the upper part and the lower part uh, so those two parts can be two different materials so it can be air uh, in this case so in order for you to know what material that is um, you can just look here so the upper part will be air the lower part will be air and then the, this will be the the source of light and as you can see um, if the materials are the same then then light will just you know continue to pass through the pass through to the second material. So now, um, for your experiment today, you will be looking at um, the angle of reflection for the first part. Angle of reflection, so this is from this part here, from the red line here, the light, going to the normal line, which is zero. Okay, so in this case, just an example, it's the angle of incidence is, um, is um, uh, 30 degrees. Now, the angle of reflection will be this. I'm going to change the material to water for this one okay so notice here um, that there is a small amount of light that is reflected so the angle from the normal line zero to this part will be the angle of reflection okay so for experiment one you will be looking at um, you will be looking you will be looking for the angle of reflection okay for four different materials so we'll start with water first so uh, in your worksheet uh, in your lab report you will see there water water at 30 degrees what will be so the 30 degrees will be this the angle of um, incidence and then the angle of reflection will be this so what do you think is the angle of reflection from this point to this point so your recording so your measurement will start from zero here and then your measurement here okay so that's for water. Now, if you will change it to 45 degrees, what will happen? And that is 45 degrees. Okay. And then if we will change this to 60, what will happen? Okay. If it's too fast, you can just pause the video. Okay. So that's for water. Now we'll go to the second part of the experiment. Uh, the second uh, material, that will be glass. So we'll change this to glass then. Um, at 30 degrees, what is the angle? Oh, so angle of reflection, sorry, angle of incidence, and then the angle of reflection will be from here. So what do you think? At 30 degrees, what is the angle of reflection for glass? Okay, pause the video. Okay, angle of reflection for at 45 degrees for glass, and then angle of reflection at 60 degrees for glass. Okay, we're good? Now, let's go on to the next one. Uh, what about uh, mystery A? Okay, so we'll start at 30 again. Okay. What is the angle? Sorry. What is the angle of reflection for 30? What is the angle of reflection for 45? What is the angle of reflection for 60? Okay. Okay, let's go now to mystery B. Um, what is the angle of reflection for 30? So make sure you complete the table here. Okay. Angle of reflection for 45. And pause the video. Angle of reflection for 60. And you are done. So that's the first part of the experiment. And what have you noticed? Okay. Um, there are some reflection questions that you need to answer for this lab. Okay. Now we're going on to the second part of the experiment. Experiment 2. Uh, we'll be looking at the angle of refraction. Okay, so angle of refraction, okay, will be uh, measured from here. So if this is the angle of incidence, okay, this will be the angle of refraction from zero here going to this, okay, zero going to this. Now, um, imagine um, for for this, from this point to this point will always be equivalent to five degrees. So it's going to be five, 10, 15, and then 20. Okay, so now let's start with the first material. Let's start with water. Okay, water at 30 degrees. What is the angle of refraction? So it's 5, 10, 15, 20. And it's a little 20, 20. Then you need to, uh, you need to estimate. Okay, 30. And then at 45. 
pause the video if you need to and then at 60 and that will be for that will be for water okay next one um let's go now to glass okay so glass at 30 glass at 45 glass at 60 okay next one mystery a mystery a for 30 oh, sorry at 30 at 45 and at 60 so make sure you pause the video okay and next one uh mystery b mystery b at 30 at 45 and at 60 okay and that's it now uh a challenge for you will be um to compare your results for your fraction and try to tell whether you know mystery a what what type of material what kind of substance mystery a and mystery b is based on uh your angular refraction and that's it um